Dude, maybe A's the play. Choking on the splits. I know the ultimate chokes are happening. All right, if it works on A, dude, that's not a coincidence. It's, co it's conspiracy. It's the Illuminati confirmed. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. All right, Illuminati confirmed. Uh, we can only go on the A split. I'm gonna be honest. The Illuminati, the Illuminati's got us, man. <laughs> Sammy chooses a new file. PBs with a 117. I don't know. First is the worst, second is the best, third is the one with the treasure chest, right? Something like that. Noki 6 chokes got nothing on the C file. <laughs> oh my. Oh gosh, my green screen gets confused when I turn. We're not gonna turn. Sammy chooses the new file, gets world record. That's honestly why I haven't chosen the new file, man. Like, I'm not, I'm not ready to be the world record holder. I can't, I, I haven't prepared mentally. I haven't, I haven't prepared mentally yet. I need to, I need to, I need to get sub 130 first. And then I'll be prepared to, to do the world record grind. I honestly think grinding for world record in this game could be really fun, but I also think it would be really, really, really difficult. <laughs> that would be legendary, it would be. Yo, thank you so much for the good luck, Kira. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. Sammy C isn't for clutch, it's for choke. I should have known. My 120 shine shows it. Oh yeah, my 120 shine, like, it's the quality run. Sammy has the world record in SMS chokes. I also have the world record for the slowest completed 120 shine run. So like, we are a world record hold. Full, full, full on. Full on world record, guys. Easy, easy clap world record. Oh my. <sighs> Proceeding with user instruction. Use the R button. To That's the wrong hole. Oni Chan. Kya. I don't get that, but I think it's hilarious. You guys want to know something crazy? We're actually already almost at 1100 followers. We're like 27 away from 1100. Like that's that's some crazy stuff. Of course, of course, Kiara. I know, I know how hard it is for like you, especially when you have like work and school in the morning. <laughs> I totally, I totally get it. I'm glad that you came by to say hi and good luck, though. I'm doing well. How are you? Oh wait, you already said that you're good. Jeez, just totally going woo, over my head. I'm not, I'm mad, man. But I'm doing well. Um, honestly, in a little bit of disbelief that I'm streaming right now with only 10 up. Like, low-key, low-key, I, I, my, my ISP was like, the best speed you're gonna get in your, in, in your apartment is 10 up, and that's like a huge stretch, and you're gonna have to like, power cycle your router every single day, and basically unplug it and replug it in to ensure that your speeds aren't tampered with, but, you know, we think it'll be enough for what you need to do. You only get 9 up, you get 0.5 up. I was getting 40 up in Colorado, and I was getting about 900 and 980 up in uh <laughs> in Maryland. So it's a little tricky. I think I had like 15 up in Tennessee. You get 90 up. That's nice. Can you imagine working with dark metal in the sun? That sounds pretty. That sounds pretty pretty hot. <laughs> I feel like metal in the sun is just not a good. Not a good uh, combination. Now, if you're talking about the legendary band Dark Metal in the Sun, that sounds awesome. That sounds like a punk band. Like, what's up, guys? We're Dark Metal in the Sun. <laughs> like, that's like what I picture. <laughs> you get four up, but it's going to change soon. I hope so, dude. The difference between five and ten has been crazy. But we're barely able to stream in 1080p with... Uh, with the, with the 10 up. So we just gotta hope that we don't do 4K streams anytime soon. I'd say 1080 at 30 for what we need is pretty good though, because honestly, everything that we have is 1080 or 30. Could fry eggs on these gutters? Oh my goodness, man. At least you could make like food while you're working though. That's like the dream. Getting fiber optic? Yo, that's what's up. They, they, they call what I have high speed internet, but it's literally, the download speed's pretty good. It's 80. I, I get 80 down, but I only get 10 up. Like, I don't understand why there's such a big disparity. 
I thought it was too funny too when uh, I spoke to I spoke to like a pretty high up person at the ISP company that I work with. Um, Objection. Um, and he was like super confused as to why I was upset about only getting five up. And he, I, t I told him that I stream on the internet, and he's like, well, your download speed's, like, pretty good. Like, what kind of job do you have where you need, like, more than that? I was like, it's not the download speed, dude. It's the upload speed. And he just, like, he had, like, an aha moment. He was like, oh, it's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude, like, that's the problem. And then, then he understood, but then he basically was like, yeah, we can't do much. And I was like, no, don't do this to me. You're getting like 108 down on average and decent upload? Yo, that'll be sick, man. The good news is, is that the city that I do live in does have uh, gigabit speeds. It's just not in the neighborhoods that I live in, you know? So that's the tricky part. No worries, Kiara. Get some rest. Thanks for stopping by. I'll see you later. Much love to you as always. It's so good to see you when you come by. It really is. Thank you for stopping by. Are we talking about megabit or megabytes? If so, you have 500. MBPS. MBPS. Which I think is, uh, megabytes. I think. Yeah, megabytes. And megabit? What's the difference? I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Wasn't it a thousand megabytes to a gigabyte though, or is that is that different? We just got a new internet box thingy which has fiber optic. Yeah, see the box here. The fastest speeds that I think the box where I live in the area that I live in offers is eighty forty, and uh, apparently that's kind of it. And I live pretty far from that box, so that's why it's. not as fast. 8 megabits is 1 megabyte. Gotcha. I don't know if it's different in the UK, but I'm pretty sure that my ISP lists things in megabytes. Or not that, but you get the idea that megabits are bigger. 1024, right. Is the B capital or lowercase? Mario? Swiggy Bong Toddy Water. <laughs> What's up, dude? I love that name. That's just too that's just too magical, man. That's too great. It's eight it 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 is eight bytes to one bit. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Swiggy Bong coming in the clutch, knowing all the information. I only know about like what internet speeds are fast, not like the technical things behind it. You average five MB. I I don't know. I I'm still like I'm comprehending what this is, but I can tell you that I I get ten Mbps. <laughs> That's what I get right now, and I'm not thrilled about it. But it seems like it's gonna be good enough for what we need to do here. Your new ISP that you're moving to less than megabits. Maybe it's the future, man. It's the future. Like the ones you currently have are old and the new ones are going to be twice as big. Gotcha. But I'm, I'm not following all that. Is the B capital or lowercase uh, in what? Oh, oh, in the, uh, in the, like, abbreviation. I see. I'm following now. I don't know. I have to, like, go on their website and check. I don't know. Speed test tells me I have 10. Whatever speed test measures in. That's, that's what I apparently have. megabit for a megabyte gotcha the only sad thing is that if you rent an apartment in hems hemsadal it will most likely have shared internet with the owner of the house 
oh, gotcha, because it's like a flat kind of situation, because I actually had concerns about that with my apartment, but my uh, ISP told me that because of how my apartment is, everybody has a, their own individual line. It all goes to the same... Excuse me, it all goes to the same box, but everybody's line is different. So I was pretty happy about that, but... As long as it's good internet, though, sharing internet's usually not a problem. Yeah, so it's megabytes. So if I have 10 megabytes, what is that, like... 1.25 mega... Or, or it's 10 megabits, gotcha. Or no. So that's like... Oh god, I can't math right now. I should be able to. This is pretty sad. It's 8, so it's... So it's 80. 8 megabit per megabyte. Okay, gotcha. Yo, it's okay, Swiggy Bond. <laughs> it's okay. I believed you, man. You sold it well. Yeah, so if we have 10... Oh, that's a good split, actually. Yeah, because 20, 20 megabits is 2.5 megabytes. So if I have 10 megabytes, then... Then, yeah, it's, uh... It's... 80. 80 megabits. Are my chats still not showing up? Now they are. What's up, Sam? <laughs> Your upload's 2.9 right now. It's sick. Mine's hopefully hovering around 10. <laughs> I can't believe it, man. Like, it's honestly such a struggle. Like, there are so many barriers for, like, people that want to stream, and getting all those barriers figured out is not easy. Like, the process that I had to go through to even get the extra 5 megs that uh, my ISP was generous enough to give me was not easy. Like, apparently they had to install, like, a double line and do, like, all this crazy stuff. And uh, nobody else in this, in, in this apartment complex gets more than 5 up, but apparently I do because my, my tech was really nice and uh, like cleared it with like whoever oversees the line here. So I don't know why I was blessed with such a nice tech, but I was pretty happy about it that they could at least do something. It's just unfortunate that it's not really... necessarily the best thing, but it's a step in the right direction. In one of your recent tests a few months ago, you had two download and 0.9 upload. How did you live? Did you check via Ethernet? Because Ethernet's gonna give you the most accurate reading. Like, if you if you have like a crappy upload speed and you're not streaming or in your streaming and you're not doing it via Ethernet, you are like making it a lot harder. <laughs> like if I didn't stream on Ethernet, I'd be so screwed. I really would be. You need to set up your PC beside your bed so you can watch Sammy and game while, uh, while you're, uh, like, bedridden from your surgery? Yeah, dude. I'm sure you'll figure something out. You'll definitely have to let us know, like, how you're recovering while that's going, like, I definitely want to hear about it. I want to make sure you're okay. You only have wireless? Oof, dude. Like, Ethernet cables are really cheap, is it just that your router isn't, like, in a location that you can plug into? Because, like, as long as it's in a location you can plug into, it shouldn't be an issue. I totally was slow on that. Hopefully you can get Ethernet when you get your new internet. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't know how internet works over there. Your router's downstairs. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, when you have, like, the tech come in, like, ask them if they can install it somewhere. Like, I'm pretty sure the router's not normally installed in, like, the room that mine's in, but they were able to install it in there, which was awesome. But yeah, how's your day going today? You post pics and be in streams, man? Sounds good, man. I'm excited. This is downstairs, and you have two cables that just go all the way up. Yeah, I know that, uh, I, I ran a cable that went all the way up and around when I was living in Tennessee for Ethernet. Oh shoot, dude. You know, obviously there's certain things that can make that tricky, like if you don't, if you, if you live in an apartment, for example, and you have neighbors downstairs or something, you obviously can. Also, if you're renting a house, sometimes you're not allowed to make modifications like that, so. 
It really is a situational thing for sure. But, you know, if you are able to do that, you know, I'd say it's worth it. You need to run the cable through a wall. Oh god. Yeah, that's tricky. I know that when I uh, do the uh, cooking streams, I'm gonna literally run an ethernet cable all the way from my room that I stream into the kitchen so I can maintain a good connection. So I'm gonna be streaming off of a laptop when I do that because I can't move my PC out there. The laptop is like an Alienware, it's an old one, but it should be able to stream just fine. It's an Alienware MX or M14X, I think, or something like that. It, I got it in like 2012, something, something along those lines. 2011 maybe? No, it had to have been 2012. Maybe not. I don't remember. I've had it for a long, long time now. It's a dusty old bean. Because I'd stream off of my Mac, but like I know that even though the computer that I have is definitely older, that the hardware is just going to be better. The CPU won't be nearly as streamed in that kind of computer. I really want to get all those cooking streams figured out, Chad. I really, I really think it would be a really cool thing for not only the stream, but just for our community to come together through food. What are some things you guys would like to see me cook on the cooking streams? Or bake, I guess, also, because like we're definitely going to make cookies and stuff, because I, I love cookies. <laughs> Like, what are, what are some things you guys would like to see? Also, if you guys do cook, what's your favorite thing to cook? It'd be cool if we could somehow incorporate, like, viewer recipes. Like, I would love to have, like, I would love to have, like, like maybe, like, a like a form or some kind of thing where viewers can, like, send me recipes and we can make some of their, like, recipes on stream. That sounds really fun. Also, that was timed perfectly. With the goopy dude. Old goopster. You like to see me bake cookies using smoked butter, tempered chocolate, and sea salt? Oh gosh, that sounds really fancy. I bake cookies by putting the cookie dough in the oven. No, <laughs> no I'm a little bit more advanced than that. But, uh, tempering chocolate's a little above my, uh, my, uh, experience level. <laughs> Smoked butter, like, maybe. Gosh, we're being, like, attacked. This is really good RNG. Uh, never mind. Well, actually, yeah, this is fine. YouTube has great tutorials for that kind of thing. I'll have to check it out. I know that uh, tempering chocolate's really, really difficult. I'd be, I'd be willing to like learn some really cool things if that's what people really wanted to see. Like, I definitely think it'll be something like that we ease ourselves into, though, in terms of like doing advanced things. <laughs> I think it'll just kind of be like, hey, let's make some cookies talk about the foods, and then play some games kind of situation. Like, I think it's definitely going to start being, like, a split thing. Depending on the circumstances, though, I'd be down to do, like, full-on five-hour cooking streams where you make something really, really complicated, you know? You need a monitor to play Mario Kart 8 later, too? That you do. Well, you could play it directly on the Switch, but... I prefer playing on the monitor, I'm not going to lie. Oh, jeez, Louise. Here's a bribe to get you motivated to learn new skills. Dang, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't have to drop the 400 bits, man. Thank you so much. That's so generous of you, dude. Gosh. Phil, Phil, Phil's like, I got you, man. Here's, here's some money to pay for a cooking class so you can learn how to temper the chocolate. I appreciate it. <laughs> Real talk, though, man. You did not have to do that. Thank you so much, you guys. It's incredibly kind of you. Gosh, when you guys, when you guys do stuff like that, it just, I never know what to say. And it's not even, like, about, like, the money, it's just about the thought behind it, like, I love when you guys put cheeky messages like that, too, like, it just, it just, it makes me crack up. You literally crack me up, chat. So much to do in so little time, I know. 
We ahead right now? We are ahead. We are ahead. We 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 in there. We in there, yo. Yo yo. Oh shoot. I'm knocking things over. It's really nice having a stream room that doesn't get hot either. This room is like pretty cool right now. Like my place in in Colorado. Oof. It, it got hot. This is the first time that you've given bits. Really? Honestly, I don't know why, but I thought you'd give him bits another time. Dude, well, congrats on getting a spicy badge. Not only do you have the sub badge now, you have the spicy cheer 100 badge, and you're 600 away from the cheer 1k badge, so that's pretty dang cool, man. I really do appreciate the extra support, man. It, it, it means a lot when, when you guys do stuff like that. It really does. And it really helps us do other things, too. I was late there. We were just late, but I was late. Whenever I'm ahead, I can never get a good Chilano skip. What? Don't go in the water. It went in the water. No, it didn't. Okay, we're good. We're fine. Even if we can just get Gelato skip third try right now, this is still pretty fine. Losing time on the gelato skip really does suck, but it's not really an issue. As long as we can get it. Yeah, that was fine. Like, it's not ideal, but that was fine. Is my computer still in the romance books? Yeah, it is. <laughs> the romance books are the clutch. But yeah, also, Phil sliding into the weekly cheer spot for uh, second right now as well, with that 400 bit donation. Playing on the Switch is a big yoke. <laughs> I'm not I'm not a fan of playing on the Switch. I almost hit the wrong shine too. I had to pick up my glass of water and put it back down for a second. I'll take a 30 second time loss on Gelato Skip. I know we got it first try in our last run, but uh, given how the early game went, I would say that this is still pretty good. Oh shoot. We're so freaking screwed. We're gonna lose more time because I apparently hit Shadow Mario too close. I got I went too close to him. I hate getting hit by him. It wastes so much time. I uh, also I don't know his pattern really well when I do not uh, get him immediately, and I know that I lose a lot of time when I don't. That's like another 20 seconds. Dang it, man. You don't get what bits are, to be honest. So basically, the easiest way to describe it is bits are a way that you can support any streamer. And uh, how it works is the streamer will get the full amount that the bits are worth compared to something else like a donation or a sub uh, subscription where percentages get taken out either by Twitch or PayPal. So like if somebody gives, like let's say somebody gives me $10 um, on PayPal. PayPal takes their fee, so the actual amount that like I would receive would be whatever minus PayPal speed that they take out. I don't know what the exact number would be, to be honest. Whereas with bits, if somebody cheers 1,000 bits, I'm actually getting all $10 worth of bits because of how Twitch has the bit system work. Essentially, when you cheer bits, um, if you actually have paid for the bits, you pay a premium on those bits, and those bits, um, those bits, you know, go to the streamer entirely. So if you buy like a dollar worth of bits, or 100 bits, the streamer will get all 100 bits, or $1 worth when you cheer them, but you're gonna pay like a dollar, I think it's like a dollar 60 or something, I don't even know. But basically, whatever you pay on top of the actual bit value is what goes to Twitch, and that's how the streamer can receive the full amount. Whereas if you just do a regular donation through another platform, or if you subscribe, Twitch takes their percentage that way. Or PayPal, depending on who it is. Oh geez, 10 more bits from Jesse. But you know, bits are also able to be gotten by watching ads and things like that, so... At least if you're in the States, I don't know how it works with the UK, because I know it's not always possible, I think, in the UK. I don't, I don't know if they ever rolled it out to other countries, I'm gonna be honest. But I know that, uh, at least in the US, you can get bits by watching ads. Damn, we were, like, really spaghetti in this up. We had a pretty good start, but then... Between Gelato 8 and 7, we had lost, like, <laughs> almost a minute. So it's pretty unfortunate, but we're, we're bringing it back. It's fine. It's another 10 seconds. 
Dude, what is even going on? <laughs> I time loss, time loss in the early game is like so so sad. But yeah, I hope I hope that explanation made sense. I don't know if it did. In my head it kind of sounded right, but when it came out it wasn't like totally right. But the easiest way to describe it is when you cheer bits, you pay a premium that goes to Twitch and the actual the actual uh, like bit amount goes directly to the streamer. Whereas if you do another way to, of contributing, it doesn't. That's probably the easiest way to describe it. I, I hope that makes sense. <laughs> What is a woo? You know, I'm not really even sure, to be honest. I I know that people say it here, and I know that I say it, but, like, I don't really know. <laughs> I'm exposed. I don't even know what it is. It could mean, like, something really obscene. I don't even know. Ooh, is a face? That's what I thought, but I wasn't sure. And a meme. I knew it was a meme, too, but... Do you need to get Yoshi from Shadow Mario to be able to do Pin of Six or just complete Pin of Four? You can't remember. I'm pretty sure as long as you unlock Yoshi within the actual, uh, the actual level, it should be fine. But come to think about it, I feel like you do have to unlock Yoshi in the pla or Shadow Mario with Yoshi in the plaza. I don't know to be honest, Digital. Since I don't use Yoshi at all in this run. Other than when we unlock Serena, I I don't know. Does anybody know in chat? I feel like you do have to unlock Yoshi in the plaza before you can use him in other levels. But I don't know. Kind of like Adventure Time faces. I never noticed that, but I could see it. Like the O's are the eyes, and then the, the the W is the mouth. I think. I don't know. I don't know what the W is, but the O's are eyes. That does he? Yeah, I almost said zeros, but they're O's. The Glod. Yeah, it did. All right, cool. Just 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 making sure. If you have any questions, like follow up with that like feel free to ask it's the w that confuses you okay yeah so the w is the mouth hmm. starbeth why is the mouth between the eyes i don't know because kids kids are crazy and they they're imaginative Maybe he's just got such a big grin on his face that he has it between his eyes. Those are definitely not the eyes. Timmy Chanka, mother's maiden name, please. Definitely not relevant to the stream, and it definitely sounds like uh, you're trying to like hack into my accounts, man. I feel like I'm talking to like a capture right now. Like, I I hate those security questions that are like they they ask you like like they're they're either really really obvious or they're something that you won't remember like it's never it's never like good when they let you write your own those are the best because then you can remember but like i swear dude it's 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 a rough time but how are you doing chimmy chimmy changa I, I i do like the name i gotta admit like chimmy changas are good and timmy changas like a great play on words but like <laughs> i'm not gonna give you my mother's maiden name i'm sorry People don't even know my last name. Like, people don't talk about my last name on stream just because that's like pretty private stuff, you know? My last name is obviously Bean. Sammy Bean. Should you use the Joy-Con grip or the straps? I never use the straps on the Joy-Con. I'm, I'm a naughty boy.
Like, I remember when I played the Smash demo, they definitely wanted us to use the, the grips, and then, like, I definitely took it off because it was too, too tight. <laughs> it wasn't, it wasn't right. It just didn't feel right, you know? Samuel Bean, that is I. I am the Bean Boy confirmed. I would say the grip's better than the, the strap, I'm gonna be honest. Then, then again, I don't really know much about it because I almost never use Joy-Cons. In most cases, I'm, I'm playing with the, uh, the Pro Controller. Oh shoot, I thought we were dead for a second, that was scary. That was incredibly scary. I would have been, been a sad bean. But yeah, I feel like captures are just getting to be more pains in the butts, so like, or like security questions. I hate those captures that are like, select like this thing and like these set of pictures. It's like, what? <laughs> what the heck, man? I'm not familiar with what that is, digital. I honestly do not know. What? Oh, spin jump. Oh, gotcha. Soin Journo. Bet you can't guess your real name. It's definitely Xanthus Eagle, dude. Don't even, don't even try to hide it. We just got so freaking trolled on that, by the way. Bert. Is it actually Bert? If it is Bert, that's pretty crazy. You got me. Dude. If Lee actually... If he actually knows me. The F's are real. This might kill me. No, it's not. We're good. Dude, that sucks. We're losing a minute because the trucks are screwed us. I'm sad. This was actually not that bad. I mean, we're still on fine pace, but like... This time loss right now is just so... Ugh. It's literally over a minute of time loss. It's not cool. You want to play the new Smash game so badly? It's it's fun. I enjoy it. I enjoy the new Smash game. I don't understand, man. He was even stopped. This shouldn't kill me, should it? No, that time he decided to not kill me. I was spared. I was spared. Jeez Louise, though, what the heck? It's like bad enough to have a death on Pianta 5, but when you have the death on uh, that section of Pianta 5 all the way at the end, it's just like, come on. Your real name's Herbert. It's definitely not Lee. Just, no, no way. Oh. <sighs> Dang, man, that's rough. Rob. pretty sloppy. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Mr. Pooh Bomb. How's it going? It's actually Bartholomew. Oh my gosh. 
Your tournament should be lit and fun though. Oh yeah. Bet you get can get bet you guys can't guess my name. Leroy Jenkins. How are you doing today, Poo Bomb? Your real name's Ricky. I actually definitely knew that. I I, I just remembered that I knew that. <laughs> Can't stay long, but this is to earn. I hope so, dude. We're we're we are we are we are we are playing pretty well, but we've had some major major spaghetti right now. I'm gonna be honest. You like urns? They're very pretty. I I I, I have to say. Oh my. I need the peeperino chat. Dude, what? There he is. Billy! This is the most stereotypical British name. I'm going to let you guess. I don't know what stereotypical British names are. The legend. I don't know. What what are what are common names in England? Edgar. Harry. <laughs> Harry is like a pretty good one. Is it Chap? Oh my gosh. I really want a snack right now, but I don't have time to get a snack. It's a real struggle. Harry, you got it? Yo, Lee knew. Lee had that inside info, man. He's from the UK. He knows. He knows the way. Huh. Yo, Wizard Harry! Oh, yeah. But yeah, I think, I think we're gonna PB soon. If we don't PB today, I think it's coming up real, real soon. We got lots of crazy things happening, chat. Just gotta, just gotta make it happen. I really want to get into these cooking streams too, I'm not gonna lie. Still enjoying the Pinnacut scene? Oh yeah. I I haven't even thought about learning Honey Skip, it's real hard. Honey Skip is like probably one of the hardest tricks to learn in this game, and the risk reward is not very good unless you're a top runner. I do want to learn EYG though, EYG makes sense to learn. And I'm gonna learn it hopefully really soon. Scalp Scab, yo what's up man, how you doing today? <laughs> What's crack lacking, my dude? I hope you are having a fantastic Wednesday so far. Uh, this should be fine. I think we slid into the cutscene. Yeah, we're, we're good. You're not a Potter fan? I'm not super into Harry Potter either. I'm gonna be honest. Like, people are always like, how can you not like Harry Potter? It's like, it's not that I don't like it. I just like, nev I've never really been super, super into it. I have some friends that are like diehard Harry Potter fans, though. They're like, I'm gonna cast a spell on you because you don't like Harry Potter. It's like, do what you want. The only spell I know from Harry Potter is like the the Leviosa one. Like, something Leviosa. It's like something something Leviosa. I've seen quite a few of the movies, but I have like only read like one of the books. You haven't been doing too well today, man. I'm sorry to hear that. You love this game? This game's a fantastic game. I love this game, too. Sorry to hear that your day isn't going that well, though, but hopefully it's gonna head in the right direction now that you're here. I got a, I got a good feeling. What's, what's, uh, what's your favorite thing about this game, Scalp Scab? I really like, uh, I really like Flood. I think Flood really adds, like, a new element to the game, and it really just makes Flood interesting. When it comes to speedrunning specifically, like the hoverless category gets really interesting because you can't use flood, but there are a lot of techs that we can do because we have flood. And I think that's pretty dang cool. Given your nickname in school used to be Hermione, you think you can figure out how much you like Harry Potter? Hermione. You like Star Wars? That's it. Star Wars is pretty good. I'm not like super into Star Wars either, though, like full on disclaimer. I think Harry Potter and Star Wars are both well. And very cool, but I'm just not into it. It's very nostalgic for you. I get that. This game's nostalgic for me, too. I was never really any good at it as, like, a young kid, though, so it's really awesome to be good at it now. Well, okay at it. I'm not, like, super, super good at it, but, like, I'm definitely not too shabby. 
Honestly, Mario Sunshine is like a pretty fun game, and I would say that if you haven't completed it, you should complete it before you sell it. But um, I can tell you that there are a lot of people that are always looking to buy Sunshine, so you should be able to sell it pretty easily. Also, you actually have the fastest version, I believe, because you are in the UK. So you have PAL, and the PAL version is very fast. And you don't have to worry about the silly goopy goop stuff on Serena 6, so... Not Sunshine Odyssey. Yeah, you guys have the fastest tech speed. You do. Honestly, Odyssey is a pretty fun game too, though. Like, I would say if you haven't completed Odyssey again, you should play. It. You should complete it at least like through like the regular game and then sell it. But I would say Odyssey is a lot of fun. I I, I definitely get nostalgia. Uh, like nostalgic vibes from Odyssey. Obviously it's a new game, but like they really did a good job with making sure Nintendo fans felt nostalgic in that game. sketch. We had to save that hardcore, but we did. We're, we're good, chat. We're good. That was a little, that was a little sketch. Fastest tech speed if you play in Spanish. It's yeah, is, is it Spanish or is it Italian? Italian? Yeah. Lee was like it's Italian. Yeah, sell it to GameStop. You got great trade in uh great great uh trade in value. Yo, Timmy Changa, thank you so much for the follow, man. I really, really do appreciate the support. Thank you, thank you, my dude. I hope you're enjoying the stream so far. And like I said, Chimmy so so I have to ask, are chimichangas your favorite thing? Or is there another Mexican food that you really like? I feel like chimichangas have to be the logical thing to pick there, but like I gotta ask, man. Are are the chimichangas like the secret to your heart of those? Are those what you love? They completely neglected the old time fans. As much as you enjoyed Odyssey, it didn't tickle your nostalgia bone. I think it tickled mine a little bit. That sounds really bad. Um I guess it I guess it varies person to person, but I think I think uh, you know, the whole like SM sixty four you know, vibe and like costume, you know, and just also like the stuff that they do in New Dawn and a couple other things that I really don't want to spoil. Um, I think it did, it was like pretty alright. I think they, they gave fans some nostalgia. You've never had one? Dang, man, you need to go out and have a chimichanga. They're good, dude. <laughs> They're good. So what's the, what's, what's the story behind the name then? Because that was like the first thing that came to my mind was chimichangas. That's too funny. GameStop's not in the UK. Oh, rip. You do plan on picking up Sunshine though soon? You're currently trying to collect the rest of the moons after completing the main story of Odyssey. So you finish Galaxy 1 and 2 as well. Yeah, Galaxy 1 and 2 are, are games that I would like to play at, that I've never, I've never really gotten a chance to play the way I'd want to. Is there not a Sunshine outfit? I think there is. I don't remember, honestly. There's none. Uh, in Newcastle, but there are some. It's just game here. Just, just game. Dude, that's, that's some crazy stuff. There's only three stores in the entire country. What? You don't like the stop part? Yeah. You never played Galaxy 2, but you really like Galaxy 1. Jesse, how's your paper going? Are you, are you, are you doing good things? Hopefully it's going well. It's, it's just called game. Yo, what's up, fighter? How's it going? Yeah, I don't want to spoil anything for Odyssey, but I, I liked Odyssey. I thought it was pretty good. I thought they did a pretty good job with it. Timmy Taco wasn't as uh, catchy. Oh, I thought Timmy Taco would be kind of cool, but I definitely, 
I definitely think Timichanga is a bit more of a better name. So if tacos are what you like to eat, uh, what, uh, what kind of tacos do you like? My favorite tacos are probably, like, shredded beef tacos or, uh, just, like, steak tacos or, like, carne asada kind of stuff, but I also do respect the, uh, the, like, carnitas tacos, you know, like, pork tacos are really good as well. What's everybody's favorite kind of taco? Chat. Do you like tacos? You're lurking? Oh snap. The paper's going good? Awesome. You were playing 64 before all of this, but you never finished that run. You have a lot on your plate. I totally get it, Jack. Like, I totally get it. There are so many games that are good that I've been wanting to play that I just have not had time to play. And it's a real struggle. Oh shoot. Mario just totally gave us the chills, man. That was some clutch plays out by, by Mr. Mario. He spared us. <laughs> Steak 100%. Respect. You like Norwegian tacos? What are those, Trey? What goes in a Norwegian taco? Tacos are so good, they are, fighter. They are. You like pizza? <laughs> pizza tacos. They closed all the UK GameStop stores. Yeah, I was gonna say, I know in America, GameStop's like kind of going under, so I'd be surprised if their international stores weren't experiencing similar things. Yeah, I really like Mexican food, to be honest. It's one of my faves. But I definitely understand why some people are into it. I feel like a lot of it's like much more of an acquired taste, or like, you know, you really have to kind of like the taste of like a lot of different dishes, since a lot of them do have very similar aspects, like, you know, with their proteins and also just with the carbs, like almost, almost like everything is like a corn tortilla. <laughs> That's so not true, but like in terms of like making a hasty generalization, that would be the true, the true hasty generalization to make. Yeah, I feel like Mexican is definitely one of those love hates, you know, like either you love it or you hate it. I do, I do respect the Mexican food. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> that was, that was weird. I've never done that. Pine, pineapple on pizza should just not exist. I feel like every stream now we talk about pineapple on pizza, guys. I think, I think we have a problem. I think we're too obsessed. It's such a hot topic, though. It's such an important issue, you know? So I definitely understand why we talk about it so much, but I swear it's like every stream now we're just like so centrally focused on this pineapple on pizza, man. Hard to explain. I'll try and read your message in a second. It looks like you explained it a little bit. We're like the people with Taco Bell that brought back the beefy crunch burrito. Like, they just, like, really wanted it and they just talked about it way too much. <laughs> and then they finally got their wish. Maybe, maybe somehow we'll get pineapple and pizza abolished. Even though, like, I honestly don't mind pineapple on pizza. Well, I don't like pineapple, but, like, I don't mind that people eat it. But maybe, maybe that'll be, maybe that'll be the end result. It's an experience, we call it Fred Das, Fred Das Taco. It's like every Friday people in Norway tend to eat a taco, gotcha. Oh my goodness, Jack, you just got way too much on your plate, man. Too much, too much stuff, not enough space. I'm doing well, fighter. No worries, I hope you're having a fantastic day as well, but I am doing well. Uh, our internet, and as you can probably tell, the stream quality looks a little bit nicer than it did yesterday, and everything's been going pretty smoothly, so I'm hopeful that things are things are going to be alright. <laughs> you swore that he said R2-D2's name wrong? Yeah, I for a second I thought he said R2-D2, I was like, what? But then I read it and I was like, oh gotcha. Sounds like a plan, Digital. The game's really not that long. It is long, but at the same time, it's really not that long as well, so... I think you'll have time to finish it. I can't believe you didn't get him there. Really? I was gonna say, I'd be very surprised. We did not get him quickly. We don't have to eat pizza? Oh my goodness. Shapes like, I like it on pizza. The next few months are going to be lit. Yeah, I can tell you that games I really want to play in the next couple of months. Um, new Kingdom Hearts game, new LM game, uh, new Smash game, new Mario Party game. <laughs> Lots of craziness. 
You like pizza? I do too. I honestly am a big fan of just cheese, but if I'm putting a protein on it, it's either pepperoni or sausage for sure. Generally, it's sausage, honestly. New Smash and Fallout, though. It's lit. Shape's still a bully. No bullying! You update me on the quest? Sounds good, man. I'll definitely try to keep you guys up to date on the partner quest, man. Like, partner is something that, like, I really want to do. I really want it to happen. And you guys are all a big part of that, so I appreciate all of you. Like, big shouts to all the viewers. Big shouts to everybody that's hanging out watching the stream. By you guys being here, hanging out, having a good time, you are helping us get one step closer to partner, so... You know, thank you guys for being people who come by and watch the stream. With your help, we will get to where we need to be. Chicken on pizza? I love buffalo chicken. I don't really like barbecue chicken pizza, but buffalo chicken? Oh, it's so good. So many new games. Yeah, alright, what game are you guys looking forward to most that's coming out? It can be on any console. Even PC. What's what's the game that you're just like, I gotta play it the second it comes out and do like a six hour marathon? Yo, what's up, Smithy? How you doing, man? You don't think you've ever had chicken on pizza? Oh, dude, chicken on pizza's good. You don't like chicken on anything, but you like it by itself, right? I could see not liking chicken on certain things. Chicken on pizza, if it's not buffalo chicken pizza, I low-key don't like it, but if it is, mamma mia, it's so good. You want to say Fob at the same time Smash? Buffalo Chicken is lit. I get I get that though, though. I, I do. Smash. Smash! Who's going to be speedrun Smash All Fighters run? Probably not me. <laughs> we can have an AC party. Barbecue Chicken Pizza? I'm not a fan. Yo, what's up, Dr. Pepper? Elder Scrolls. But who knows when that is? Yeah, for sure, man. I'm sure it'll be eventually. But when it does come out, it's gonna be, it's gonna be sick. You got your Switch all set up? Yo, let's go, Regenic. That's awesome. Yeah, I saw your friend request and I did add you. I'm sure you know that because I think it tells you if you get a, a, a new person added, but I, I did add you. I was like, who's this friend request? And I was like, it's Regenic. LM3. Yeah, LM3 is gonna be amazing. I have really high hopes for LM3. When are we doing the, uh, the co-op, the co-op LM speedrun for 3DS? When are we getting a world record? I think I don't think you can do it over online though. I think you have to be in the same place, yeah? If you have to be in the same place, I'm just gonna have to fly out to Scotland. We're gonna make it happen. You're really looking forward to Animal Crossing and LM3 so you can make fake online friends. Oh my gosh, Smithy. Oh my gosh. Also, if you guys are looking to play Mario Kart today, make sure you do have Switch Online because it did go live last night. And you do have to have it to do the online stuff now, which kind of sucks, but... You get 150, like, gold points. For you, it's Animal Crossing, LM3, Mario Party, and Smash. Those are solid picks. If you don't both have a copy, you can only do the boss rush thing. Right. Right, right. That I, that I did hear about, but if you both have the copy, even if you're not in the same place, can you do the co-op or no? You can do it online. Oh, okay, cool. Alright, yo, this the, it's happening, man. We're making it happen. I don't care if we have to buy you a copy of the game, we're making it happen. <laughs> LM3 and Halo Infinite. Halo is really fun. I haven't played Halo in a long time, because I haven't really liked some of the newer Halo games, but I love Halo. A friend from another streamer hooked you up with your family plan? That's what you are saying. What's LM3? Luigi's Mansion 3. They announced it's coming out in 2019. Uh, it's kind of similar to Dr. Pepper, except it's like a fraction of what Xbox Live costs. It's $20 a year, so it's really not like super expensive, but it's definitely still a bit of a nuisance, and you know, I'm sure it's still definitely a struggle for some people as well, so that's what they decided to do. We're also bringing this run back slowly, guys. Yeah, it's not bad. We can play Halo 2. Halo 3 is my favorite. Halo 2 is pretty lit, though, I will say. Is there a Luigi's Mansion 2? There is. Um, it's Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon in America, and in Japan it's actually called Luigi's Mansion 2, but uh, it's for the 3DS. It's the remake that... Or not the remake. It's like the sequel that people didn't really like. So I think they're trying to kind of go back to home console and go with the Switch for LM3, which is what I figured when they released the remake of the original on the 3DS as well. 
Yeah, I saw that. It's pretty dang sick. The family plan option, like, it's pretty good, man. Like, at least Nintendo's making the prices reasonable, and I feel like... Shoot. I feel like, um... You know, the reason that they're charging for it is because there's some kind of overhead cost that's, like, hopefully justifiable. At least that's my... That's my opinion. Like, I feel like Nintendo wouldn't charge unless they had to, and I mean, I'm sure there are ways for them to not charge, but I feel like if it makes the service more reliable and allows them to maintain it better, I would say that it's worth paying. That should be fine. Uh. <laughs> I was so worried. I even turned my whole body. I was like, oh god. Alright, we're just gonna play this nice and safe. Everything is fine. <laughs> I think. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. We did lose some time because of our little tumble we took getting to the level, but we're on sub-133 pace. Halo Reach was awesome too. Halo Reach was the last Halo game I really liked. Although you don't play them on your Switch itself, play them in docked and they burn the Switch screen temporarily. temporarily. You get NES games to play with online? Oh, do they actually? I honestly have noticed that my Switch is kind of scuffed around the edges from it always being in the dock. But I don't know if it's because of, like, the times that I pull it out of the dock that the dock scratches the screen or not, but, like, I don't know, man. <laughs> oh, it's UK- in the UK it's LM2 as well. Yeah, in America it's Dark Moon. That's what they call it anyway. We all know how the Nintendo wi uh, Wi-Fi went. Uh, I'm not sure I know how the Nintendo Wi-Fi went. Also, this run's pretty alive, I'm gonna be honest. It's obviously not the perfect scenario, but I would say that this run's pretty, pretty lit right now. I would love to be on a much better pace than this, but I would say we're doing pretty good. You loved it, but not as much as the original, so you'll happily pay 35 pounds for the 3DS version? Yeah. Oh, I already have it pre-ordered. I did switch the pre-order to my credit card just in case. Because I thought about it, and I don't know, like... It's always safer to put it on a credit card. Overhead Splatoon 2 is P2P. Person to person. I'm not sure I'm following. You'll do a co-op run? What the hell, Salmon? What do you mean, Regenic? You're not involved with Nintendo stuff, but you never heard of LM2? Yeah, it wasn't really talked about that much because people didn't like it. <laughs> you always use the Switch in handheld mode? I always use it in docked. The Wii and original DS online service, it closed down in 2014. Oh, gotcha. I didn't know what it was called, but I definitely used it. I know it was pretty unreliable, though. The original version is quite rare, and you have to pay about £25 for its second hand in most shops. You're talking about, like, the one for the GameCube, Jack? Yeah, I know that PAL, uh, it costs, like, a crap ton of money to get PAL in, uh, America. Like, I'm talking, like, about 80 US between buying the game and then shipping. I was really fortunate that a person that lived in the UK hooked me up with a copy and I only had to pay for shipping, but it was still pretty expensive. You know, PAL is not cheap, <laughs> but the version's really cool. I'll be curious to see if they have the, the Hidden Mansion be how it is in PAL uh, in the remake or not. I feel like it makes sense but also it's Nintendo, so you just never know. <laughs> you just never know. Yeah, the GameCube one, gotcha. It's because you never had a TV to play on, gotcha. Yeah. I do, I do have PAL, and uh, I've actually done PAL runs before, Jack. Uh, it should be up on the YouTube channel and also in the VODs. Uh, I could actually show you my PAL copy if I had a minute. Honestly, PAL, PAL copy games look way nicer. It's genuinely very difficult even for an experienced player, yeah. I want to say our PB is a 140-something. I don't remember. I haven't done PAL runs in a long time, but I really want to get into PAL at, at one point. At some point. One way or another. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're doing pretty good. 
We're 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 hanging around. We're we're keeping this run alive. I'd be really hyped if we PB. I really want sub 135 though. I'd take what I could get though. I'm gonna be honest. We have like a little bit more. We have a couple of dicey shines left, but if we can make those really well, then we're good. P2P is an online server type. Say you're playing Call of Duty on your screen, you would be around a corner, but on someone else's screen, there would be a delay so they could see you. Like a second late meeting, you would essentially be able to be killed around a wall. Gotcha. Yeah, that's that's some crazy stuff. I gotcha. I think I know what you mean. It's the best way you can describe it. Uh, you normally can't. My uh, Wii is homebrewed, so I can. <laughs> but, uh... I don't really use it for anything other than using Nintendo to play that specific uh, game. Once we get JP uh, Sunshine, we're gonna just play on our JP Wii exclusively, because the JP games that I have, I play on a JP Wii. Because, why not? <laughs> if I have the Japanese Wii, why use Homebrew? But yeah, you normally can't, but with Homebrew you can very easily do it. I'm surprised. I feel like you've definitely seen us do power runs, but maybe maybe I'm forgetting. But definitely check them out. We have it up on uh, YouTube. I'm kind of worried about doing the spin jump, I'm going to be honest. You're safe that you'll still be able to play Mario Kart with the bean? Oh yeah, it's going to be amazing. Yo, Xanthus, like in the YouTube channel, like a champion. If you guys have not checked out the YouTube channel, make sure to check it out. We got lots of cool PB vids and also like some other, you know, various stuff. I'm trying to get more on that channel, but it's just been a struggle. We're actually just going to be patient. We're going to play this safe because I don't want to lose the run. <laughs> We're going to play it incredibly safe. The B in my name stands for boy. That man's filthy. Yep. You've caught me. That was really close to not being good. We played that really safe. I didn't want to die. It's all good, though like that we're ahead. I could have tried to go for the slide there, but I was not confident. I really wasn't. No, Smithy! <laughs> no! Just start a seven day trial and then cancel an auto renew meeting. No money will be taken after seven days. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the play. That was scary. I had to do some really dicey things. But yeah, doing the doing pal is like playing the game like while you're like drunk. It's like really ridiculous. Pal is pretty dang crazy. Yo! Wow, Luigi time. Throwing out the raid. I haven't gotten the alert. But if you are raiding me, man, thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? How are you doing? Hopefully things were spicy. I don't remember the last time we were ahead out of Bianco Hills with this PV chat, do you? Um, <laughs> I don't remember. I feel like it's been a very hot minute. When only the real people who care about you are online. Yo, online friends are best friends, man. Like, people online are great. I mean, obviously not everybody online is great, but there are definitely some spicy people online. You once tried playing Call of Duty drunk, your KD was not happy. I almost realized your kid was not happy. I was like, wait, you have a kid? <laughs> That's some crazy stuff. That's too funny. It's going well, man. How are you? I'm, I'm doing pretty good because we actually have good enough internet to stream right now. And it's really surreal because I was almost certain that we were not going to have the right internet in the, at this place when they told me the speeds once I had actually moved in, which were very different than the speeds that I was told when I was inquiring about moving. So I'm doing well, man. Things are good. I'm feeling real chill. Best world in the game right now. Yo, Serena Beach is my favorite too, Timmy. I love Serena Beach. You really only have online friends and they're all great? Exactly. 
17 year old kid seems about right for the UK. There are definitely some people I know in America that I went to school with that had kids when they were young, but you know, like, I don't judge. Sometimes things happen, and also, like, just because somebody's a young parent doesn't mean they can't be a good parent, so, you know, like, I don't judge, man. As long as they're a good person, that's all that matters to me. As long as they treat their kids right, you know. Yo, the real Caleb plays. How's it going, man? Thank you so much for the host. Hopefully you're having a good day today. It's good to see you, man. Oh, shoot. We're out of water. Are you serious? That was some, some baloney. Crack lacking, my dude. Hopefully, you're doing well. It's good to see you, Caleb. Doing better than you did yesterday. Your stream went pretty well today as well. Awesome, dude. I'm so glad to hear it. Jesse should draw the mantis for sure. You were gonna host while you were streaming, but you couldn't figure out how to do it? No worries, man. You just type in your uh, chat slash host and then the name, space, and then the name of the channel you wanna host. But I totally get it. It's it's a bit confusing for sure. All right, that was actually pretty clean, Manta. How was your stream though? Hopefully it was well. It's good to see you, man. I can't stress enough how good it is to just see everybody in the chat right now. Like you guys, like just make me smile. <laughs> you really do. So big shouts to everybody. Like I like I said, I can't express enough how much you all mean to me. You can't get a girlfriend or even organize yourself, so definitely not ready for the kid for the years to come. Me too, man. I'm, I'm a solo bean for now, but also, like, I definitely could not have a child right now. I'm, like, almost 20 years old, and I'm just like, nah. <laughs> like, late late 20s, like, okay, maybe. I have a lot of crap I need to take care of before I even worry about having kids. The lady the lady situation, like, I'm open to it, you know, like, I I think, I think, I think having a girlfriend would be kind of alright, but I'm not, like, looking, you know? It's kind of one of those things that if it's, if it's gonna happen, it'll kind of happen naturally. So I'm just kind of doing my bean thing, and maybe one day there'll be a girl to do the bean thing with too. That sounds really bad. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have worded it that way. I swear, so many things could be taken out of context in the stream, and I would just look like a complete doofus. I really would. You feel you on that? If it happens, it happens exactly. Like I find that when you force yourself into a relationship or are actively searching. It can almost be bad for what you're, you know, really trying to accomplish. Also, like, I have so much to focus on other than women right now, man. Like, I have to make sure the stream's going well. I have to make sure my, like, you know, stuff outside of the stream's going well. Oh, shoot. That was real scary. Chat, why do I get so scared? Stream went good? Awesome. Glad to hear it, man. Everybody deserves that good stream. Yeah, you type it in your own chat. It's, like, pretty... It's pretty weird, I'm gonna be honest. It's a pretty weird thing. Like, it's not just you. Nice. All girls do is laugh at you? Dude, that's just because they're like, damn, I can't believe how handsome Regenic is. That That's what it is, man. They're just laughing about how handsome you are. So do you get your stream schedule over the weekend? Uh, what do you mean? My stream schedule is the same. It's been the same. It's uh, Monday through Friday. We're not doing weekend streams right now. I don't know if we'll open up to weekend streams soon. But for at least now, it's Monday through Friday. That wastes like a second or two.
I know some people in the chat actually do have kids, and I like commend you guys. Like, having kids sounds like it's hard. <laughs> I'm not a fan. I mean, I am a fan, but like, when I think about it for myself, I'm just like, uh, having a miniature Samu is not a good, good thing to think about right now. I have other things to think about. This is gonna be fine. What? <coughs> Dude, this time loss is sketching me out, I'm gonna be honest. Just a little. Gotta grow out some long luscious hair. The ladies love it. Oh yeah, dude. Gotta get the man bun going. You gotta get your partner to focus on Sam. <laughs> oh my goodness. You got chores? No worries, fighter. Take your time. What time do I usually stream on Friday? Uh, same time as I normally do. 4 p.m. Eastern to 9 p.m. Eastern-ish. The stream time's the same every day, and the days are the same usually week to week. Uh, I was talking about how our most recent sub goal that we hit, we actually might do a stream on Saturday for that sub goal specifically, just because during the week I work, and I wouldn't be able to take a whole 12 hours to do the 12 hour stream, so that's kind of the logic behind that, but there might be some wiggle room, but maybe we will just do a Saturday stream. Yeah, the long hair, man, it's the clutch. I ash I used to have some long hair. I didn't have, like, really long hair, but uh, I did have pretty long hair. One of our mods, Mr. Bathius, had long hair a long, long time ago. And it, it was definitely an adjustment when he decided to not have long hair anymore. Alright, here we go. This is a really important shine. Shoot, dude. This is fine. We're gonna still save time, but everything's gonna be weird now. Because we didn't make that cycle. We're gonna have to go the other way. <laughs> Which is really strange. I just didn't want to tie. Took another second there because I was like, oh geez. We did make the first part of the cycle, which is kind of nice. I'm really scared about this momentum spin. Okay, we're fine. My heart, my heart's like beating out of my chest from that. That was real scary. You used to have long hair too longish. Xanthus has long hair. I'm not surprised. That's why he's the sexy bean dude. He must be a sex icon. I love it. I didn't even see Lee's message. This is why I love Lee. Lee and I are always on the same page, man. Yeah, we're 20 seconds ahead right now. We are indeed 20 seconds ahead. No, no Johns. All right, if we get good RNG on King Boo, guys, we could actually be close to a minute ahead. Xanthus, what's your secret? How are you such a sexy man? Oh shoot. <laughs> I definitely almost dropped a swear just now. I, that wasn't even, like, something worth dropping a swear over, but, like, it was just, like, pretty funny. I was watching a YouTuber's video the other day. Uh, I think it was on Listed Leaf. And, uh, he never, like, swears in his video. Sometimes he'll say, like, a swear word, but, like, he definitely said, the, like, the S word, right? And, uh, he just, like, put, like, a beep in it. <laughs> like, I've never seen it like that. Like, he, he definitely just was, like... He definitely said it, and he had, like, his editor, I am assuming he has an editor, just edit it out. Like, instead of cutting the video, it just went, like, beep! <laughs> and I was just like, wow. <laughs> I've definitely dropped a swear or two on stream before. If you dug around hard enough, you probably could find them. I don't think there are any PBs that I've sworn in, though. Alright. I feel like there actually could be, but I don't know. I'll let chat figure it out. You guys can find a swear of me. Uh, I'd be impressed. I feel like there are some though. If you if 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 you look hard enough, I feel like there's at least a clip somewhere. Want to exchange friend codes? I already have you added, Regina. If you guys want to add me on the Switch and you haven't, uh, make sure you type exclamation point FC. Or once we do our casual stream uh, later. You'll be able to uh, add me over that way too. Alright, nice. Dude, the bubbles scare me. 
I'm not a fan. It all started when you were born with a full head of hair. Oh my goodness. You sound like my brother. My brother had a full head of, head, uh, head of hair when he was born. I was a bald bean. I was, I was a bald bean. Nice. Alright, are we really gonna get perfect RNG? I don't believe it. If we get perfect RNG, that'd be sick. Dude, let's go. Let's go. Perfect RNG. Yes, queen. Google's the same, be swearing on stream. Oh yeah. Yeah, we saved like a good 20... Three seconds. That's fine. I don't know what the ten seconds went to be honest, but that's fine. Swearing's always necessary. You got yelled at so bad for swearing the other day. You live in basically an old folks' home. Yes, it's awful. And Jen almost got caught in the door and hurt. And you swore at least, uh, and at least three people were like, "That's hardly necessary." Insert lecture here. Oh my goodness. You're a grown woman, Pixie. Like, screw them. <laughs> you had a bowl cut for the longest time. What, what do you rock now? Have you ever, like, thought about rocking the man bun, dude? I feel like the man bun could be the play. I think some people look really good with the man bun, but then some people don't, so... It's, like, something that you have to, like, experiment with. But if it looks good on you, dude, like, it's, like, the clutch. It's the way to the women's hearts. The women can never say no to the man bun. Oh yeah, you're watching a door shot on your dog because some woman move exactly. I definitely think swears can be justifiable for sure. Oh god, sub 135 still very possible, but like we need a really clean. If we can somehow gold Noki four, dude. Oh man, that'd be some sick stuff. I am in a deep deep state of con concentration. Will there be Mario Marty versus the viewers? Mario Party? Oh yeah. I don't know how it works. I think we can do mini games and stuff, but yeah, I'm definitely planning on that too. Elise actually says if you're caught swearing a Cecily, you'll be written up and possibly evicted. What kind of BS is that? I I definitely do not have that written in my lease. I just like can't like have other people live here that aren't supposed to. That's pretty much the only rule. That's ridiculous. What kind of craziness is that, Pixie? Like that's some next level. Craziness. Freaking heck yeah, dude. Pixie does live in the US, yeah. Alright. So we're on 134 pace right now. We can gold Noki 4. Um, Noki 4 is probably the only thing we can gold confidently, but uh, sub 135 is so in reach right now, dude. I don't see how they can legally have you obligated to not swear. Like, what's what's the reason? It's like, um, I was, uh, like, looking at schools, and, uh, I forget what it was. This is, this is, this was in Maryland. There was a school in Maryland, and I was looking into their program, and I was, like, getting information on the program. There's this one really ridiculous class, and I asked them about it. I said, what's up with this class? Like, why do I have to take it? Is this a part of the major? And they're like, yeah, you do. And then I was like, oh, okay, like, well, what's the reason? Because it was, like, something completely irrelevant, like... Or maybe it was, like, a requirement for all the students, and I literally was like, why? Like, what, what's the purpose for it? And they could not tell me a legitimate answer. They were like, oh, because that's how it is. I was like, okay, that's great, but why am I gonna... You know, why, why should I come here and take this irrelevant class that you don't even have a reason for? <laughs> like, what the heck is that? Like, I, I, I really think it's silly when people don't have, like, a reason for something. Like, especially when it's, like, trivial things like that, it's like, what, do you just want me to have to pay for another class? Like, and in your case, it's like, what, you, you, you don't want me to 
be somebody who can speak freely. <laughs> this isn't jail, this is this is an apartment. That's not how free speech works. Oh, here, let's see. We want a happy, friendly, wholesome environment, sure, but telling me you want to kill your service dog gets no punishment? Oh my goodness. That's some messed up stuff. You understand, or you don't know anything, hopefully that doesn't happen though. That would be so bad. That'd be messed up, yeah. I would, I would sue your complex, honestly. Like, I would file a lawsuit if I was evicted for swearing. You need to take so many irrelevant courses. I know, college is... Uh, I can't even... We can't even have this conversation right now, but college is like... That's why I haven't gone back to school yet. Like, the stream is way more important than school right now. Like, for obvious reasons. And like, I want to go back to school, but like, at least I know what to expect with the stream. Like, with school, like... so Especially when you're transferring, schools can be a real pain in the butt. They really can. I have to make sure I don't die here. I've accidentally died on this level before, uh, because it is something that involves an out-of-bounds clip. So we just have to make sure we don't die. We also can't have a really bad corona. I'm worried about that too. But yeah, part of the reason I haven't gone back to school is because... There, I've inquired at some schools and they've definitely like told me things that I'm not necessarily thrilled about and I'm waiting to find the right school and also I'm making sure I can focus on the stream and you know do what I need to do for you guys too. Because the stream is like my long term goal you know like I, I want to be doing this for a long time. That should be fine I hovered long enough I think. Yeah that was real scary. <laughs> I was worried. Alright nice. Jenna's been physically assaulted and you've been sworn at so many times mansions for sons to get rid of Jenna. That's messed up. It sounds like where you live is pretty damn terrible, Pixie. Like, that's that's messed up. Like, some apartment complexes are terrible. I know I've lived in some pretty bad places. And, you know, knock on wood, the place I'm living in now is good. But, like, I know how hard it is to not only find something that's affordable, but, like, a place that's nice. Like, where I was living in Colorado, it wasn't a bad complex, but, like, any issues that we had with our unit, they basically used the term, and that quote, it's an old building. Like, it's like, our fridge doesn't really work properly. It's an old building. Our cabinets, like, have, like, disgusting stains in them. It's an old building. Our door doesn't lock. It's an old building. Like, I totally understand... You know, obviously not to the extent of what you've had to go through. I'm very thankful that I haven't had to go through something like that myself. But, like, apartment complexes sometimes can just be awful. They really can be. And I'm sorry to hear that that's, you know, something that not only you have to go through, but also Miss Jenna, because she's just a good pupper. She shouldn't have to go through such things. Where's the frickin' coin, dude? Where's the beef? I'm so sad. We missed the coin. What? No, 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 no. Do not choke this. <laughs> Do not choke this, Sammy. Can't be doing this. We're losing time on this segment because the coin decided to not be nice. And by the coin, I mean Mario just did not grab the coin the way I thought he would. Oh, dude, that fish is you. I did go to college. Yeah, I was in college studying communications, but, uh,. I had things come up that weren't related to the stream because I wasn't streaming yet, but uh, basically while I was out of school I decided to start streaming and that was the best choice I ever made. Exactly. That's like saying get rid of your child. Oh yeah, for sure. Alright, everybody hope for a good eel. If we have a good eel, PB is like incredibly possible. Even with a bad eel, PB is possible, but sub-135 will probably die if we don't have a good eel. We lost 20 seconds on a shine that we should have not lost any time on, but you know, it's fine. We have to we have to channel our inner beanie boy right now. Use this shortcut to go to grandpa. Yes, ma'am. I think. Sir. No P bean. Oh shoot. <laughs> Damn it, dude. Are you serious? That sucks. It's not RNG related, but who cares? It is. It depends on whether or not I need, I'm gonna choke or not. That's all RNG. That's what you wanna do, you aspire to be like me and a couple other streamers. Dude, I appreciate that so much. Like, 
I definitely still have a long ways to go before this becomes my full-time job, and it's never really been something that was, like, my primary focus, but since the stream's gone the way that it's been going lately, like, oh jeez, 100 bits from the Game Bandit. Dude, thank you so much for the bits, man. How are you? That's so kind of you. Since the stream's been going the way it has, like, I've just, you know, it's be become more of a real thought, which is kind of crazy to think about, I'm gonna be honest. Um, but, you know, I'm definitely trying to make sure that I... from the game, Ben. What a madman. You're doing well, man. I'm glad to hear it. Thank you, thank you for the support. That's just incredibly kind of you, dude. Snagging up that cheer three spot as well. What a savage. Nope. Don't get swallowed. It's gonna be a three cycle. This is pretty fast three cycle, I'd say. Streams frozen? No. No frozen streams. We dropped we dropped a couple more frames, so maybe that's what happened. Can we can we please have the, the fishy fish come up now? Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Fishy Fish. That cutscene skip was a little dicey, but we made it work. PB is still alive, and sub-135 is really close, but I think it can happen. I think it can happen. Not when the shine's all the way over there, though. Shoot, dude. We're racing. We're racing against the finish right now. Oh, man, I don't know. Sub-135 might be dead, but PB is very alive. Damn, dude. Losing that time on Noki 4. Ugh. If we can gold Noki 6 or Corona Mountain, I think it's doable. Oh, man, dude. If I don't choke, it's a glitch in the simulation. Honestly. Honestly. You're slowly making your way up there. 10 followers from affiliate. Yo, let's go, man. You'll get there soon. You just gotta keep grinding. It took me over a month to get affiliate. Well, it was like about a month. But, uh, you know, I'm definitely on the partner grind, and that's a much more lengthy grind. But you just gotta be in it for the long haul, and you just gotta keep up the good vibes and just keep up the good work. Like, you know, you gotta you gotta prioritize your content more than anything else. Like, especially when it comes to just raw numbers. Like, there are so many streamers, uh, big and small, that worry about numbers. And, like, we're all guilty of it, for sure. But, like, if you just focus on your content and making sure that the people that are there are appreciated and you're having a good time, I guarantee you that you will continue to grow and numbers are, will be something that you don't really worry about for a while. Or at all, like, you know, it's way easier to not worry about numbers when you have something like affiliate or a partner because, you know, then you're not really worried about hitting averages and stuff. But, like, ensuring that, you know, your stream is a good place just in general should always be the top priority and, like... There are so many great creators out there, and like a lot of the time, you know, they're they're not heard of, or they're not, you know, seen because of things like numbers. But if you just keep doing what you're doing, man, like people people will find you. You will find your people, your bean people. <laughs> Is Mario Kart after this run? Probably. We're gonna probably do a lot of Mario Kart today, cause Mario Kart's like the play, but I, you know, like, I, I truly mean it when I say it, man. Like, you just gotta keep grinding and just focus on what's important, and that's not the, the raw numbers. It's the, it's the people that are there, it's your content, and it's also just, you know, making a stream the most important thing to you as well. Like, low-key, other than, like, my family, stream comes before everything. It really does for me. 
And, you know, I think of you guys as, like, a second family, and that's kind of why, you know, I think about my IRL family, and then I think about the stream family, and I'm like, alright, gotta make sure the stream family is doing what they're doing, and that I can do what I need to do for them, and that's why, you know, the last couple of days with the stream being not the way that I wanted it to be because of the internet, that's why I was so adamant about making sure that everything got fixed, because this is, this is my life. <laughs> you guys are my life. But actually, like, I, I, you know spend a lot of time inside and outside of the stream making sure that things are good for everybody here and that the stream can be the best it can possibly be. Oh shoot. Alright, sub... The sub, uh... The sub 135 is probably there, but that's okay. Died, but that's alright. Well, we didn't die, but. That was really close to not working. I'm I'm so so nervous right now. <laughs> Getting this PD would be really nice. I swear, whenever I go through like a dry spell of not playing, we uh, PB. It's really weird. I waited a second, but I just wanted to make sure that I wasn't doing something stupid. But that's kind of a trick question, because I'm always doing something stupid in this game. When I play the game, I do something stupid. That's just kind of how it works. I've never felt this nervous going into the end game. Shoot, dude. We lost a lot more time than I thought. The camera audio is stupidly out of sync. Oh, jeez. I'll have to fix it. Sometimes OBS is just really mean, and that's why, but the audio shouldn't be desync. The settings don't really change, but I will definitely take a look at it for sure. <sighs> Even if we PB by like two seconds, if we get the sub 136, I'll be very happy. <laughs> Focus on the run. I'm trying. We have time save on Karuna because we died on Karuna in that Bowser fight. That was a pretty good start. Nice. Yeah, I can't believe that we uh, we fell during that Noki. The audio is fine, just sync for the camera is out of sync. Get the PV. Oh, so I, I, know, I know what you mean. I can try and fix that. I don't really know why that's happening but it shouldn't be and i can i can look into it i probably won't be able to fix it until after the stream just like full-on disclaimer but but yeah <laughs> all right we're on pb pace and it's like a pretty small pb but like <laughs> it'll be a big pb if we make it happen i really wanted sub 135 though damn it <laughs> but it's fine like i'm very happy with with this kind of pace Cause I know sub 135 is soon. Maybe I'll have to learn EYG. If we PB, I'll try and make an effort to learn EYG pretty soon. Yo, what's up, Switch? I will try not to mess it up, man. I'm trying my best. Don't worry about it now. PB and J? Oh yeah, the best kind of PB. The best kind. Do we go for the fast cycle? I guess we should. That wasn't that fast. Uh. Depending on how... Oh god, the fish. I don't want to... I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to wait. I could have probably made that, but I don't want to risk it. So... <laughs> I'd hate to not PB because I went for something really silly. Because whether whether we sub 135... Or, well, we can't sub 135 this run, so... Like, whether we 135, 30, or like something else, like... It doesn't really matter at this point. I just want to not die doing this boat right now. And that's what I'm focusing on right now is not dying during the boat. Okay, that was fine. That was pretty slow, but it was fine.
get on the thing, man. I haven't done rocket storage in a little while. What? That was really weird. That's ah, fine. It's fine, that's not enough time to, like, not let us PB. It's possible. Store three rockets. I do store three rockets. I don't know how to do the whole fancy two rocket storage, you know? How how close is this PB gonna be, though, Poo Bomb? Like, if I die here, am I, like, screwed? I really hope I'm not, but I feel like I am. I'm a little worried. Alright, well, here goes nothing. Go ham for the PB. Right, well, we're gonna try our best here. If we choke the PB, like, so be it, but I don't think we're going to. Well, maybe. <laughs> After that, maybe. Alright, we're gonna PB. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. Ah, oh, yes, dude. I know it's like a pretty small one, but like, we broke the sub 136, so we technically accomplished our goal. <laughs> GG's. Damn, that was a little scary. Five seconds, but we take those. <laughs> AM Radio Vision, what's up, man? By five seconds, Pog. <laughs> yo, Gaina, coming in just in time. He's like, yo, let's go. The pee pipe. Hey, I mean, yo, we'll take it. First PB in the new place. Um, pretty happy, honestly. The audio synced. It's all magic, dude. The stars are aligning. I believed in the heart of the cards. I wonder why the audio is desyncing and resyncing. It could just be something weird with OBS, but I'm just gonna assume it's fine. I'll look into it. Yo, thank you for the congrats, man. Yo, we did it. <laughs> Got the peanut butter and jelly. Honestly, we haven't PB'd in a little while, so that was nice. I'm, I'm pretty happy about it. Big shouts to all the viewers, though. You guys rock. Like, Big, big shouts to everybody that's here hanging out, watching the stream. I hope you are enjoying the stream so far, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic day today. Just big shouts to everybody in general. Like, You guys always believe in me, and it means a lot. And It's been a rough couple of days for me, just in general, and with the stream, too, so the fact that we can PB today and... Just have a good time today. It means the world, so. Big shouts to you guys. You're amazing. Stay amazing and stay awesome. Like, I really do appreciate it. I appreciate you guys being here, and I appreciate you guys just bringing the good vibes, as always. I'm also going to grab a snack. I'm really hungry. I'll be right back. Junior, I've got something difficult to tell you about Princess Peach. I know. She's not really my mama. Some days, when I'm bigger... Wanna fight that Mario again? That's my boy. Well put, son. The Royal Koopa Life is as strong as ever. But for now, let's just rest a while. This PB was like the ultimate comeback. Also, Xanthus dropping the spicy important links. Definitely check out our Discord server if you haven't already. 
is a great way to stay connected to the stream and just be amazing. <laughs> so definitely make sure you check it out. Also the YouTube channel and the Twitter and the merch store. Definitely, like, you know, scope out the merch because we're going to be doing a merch giveaway when we hit our next sub goal, so definitely, definitely make sure to scope out the merch so you know what the awesome piece of merch that we're giving away is going to look like and also so you know how good it'll look on you when you win it. <laughs> Also, if you guys have not dropped a follow to the actual Twitch channel, make sure you guys do. It really, really does help the stream out, and it really does mean a lot to me. But, uh, yeah, like I said, big shouts to the viewers. Big shouts to everybody hanging out watching the stream. I hope you're enjoying the stream so far. We did hit 100, yeah. We're at 99. <laughs> but we did hit 100, yeah. We're currently at 99 now. But, yeah, we had a really good early game, and then Gelato Skip was weird, and Gelato 7 was weird, too. And then we had fine things. We died on uh, Pianta 5 at the end of the level. And then we just slowly brought the run back, you know? We kept it, we kept it real, we kept it fresh. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that run. I hope you guys have been enjoying the stream so far. I think we're gonna shift gears over and play some Mario Kart. Uh, so that's gonna be a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, big shouts to the viewers, big shouts to the SMS community, and big shouts to the spicy peebs. We did it. We freaking did it, chat. We did it, Reddit. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna keep grinding. Sub-135 is really, really soon, obviously. We had a pretty solid run um, with so many mistakes, though, and we PB'd. So there's there's way, 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 way too much room to improve right now. Uh, so we're going to be doing that, and it's going to be awesome. And I cannot wait to improve with you guys. But yeah, that's going to do it for Sunshine, I think. We're going to we're gonna hop over to Mario Kart, and it's going to be lit. But the grind's going to continue, man. Probably tomorrow, honestly. <laughs> Maybe we'll take a day off from Sunshine because we PB'd, but probably tomorrow. The grind never stops, you know? But yeah, let's do it. Let's get the let's get the spicy